Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. I'm Kylie. And I'm Ange. And today we're watching Avatar The Last Airbender Season 3, Episode 12. So Zuko's trailing behind Aang. He's ready to, to help him out. Mm -hmm. The last two episodes were some of the best of the series. Uh, we had the invasion. And uh, unfortunately, it looks like Ozai and the Fire Nation kind of won that bout. Yeah, we got all of the dads and like middle-aged men uh, left behind. But at least the gang and Teo. I'm not sure about Haru. At least they've sort of escaped. Yeah, we do presume that Iro or Iron, as he's now referred to as, uh, will be staying behind to help the prisoners out. Mm, yeah. But anyway, should we get into it? Let's get into it. Oh, it looks like Haru is there. Yes, he is. They're spent, man. They did so well. This is humiliating. Do you mean getting thoroughly spanked by the Fire Nation or having to walk all the way to the Western Antarctic? Both. Sorry, guys, but Appa gets tired carrying all these people. Hey, we're here. I can feel it. Oh, shit. Eyes are below. Okay. Oh, wow. Cool. Oh. Nice and hidden. Hmm. From the bloody Fire Nation. <laughs> As Zuko rocks up. <laughs> yeah. Who's to say they're actually going to allow Zuko to help as well? It's going to take a lot. They're not going to trust him at all. But Aang kind of needs it. Let's yep. check it out. You just need to master all four elements and confront the Fire Lord before the comic comes. Oh, yeah. That's yeah, that's so easy. easy. I'll just do that. <laughs> well, it's not even going to be possible. Where am I supposed to get a firebending teacher? It's Can funny you say that. Yeah, right. No one knows where Jong Jong went, man. An unbothered queen. <laughs> Hello, Zuko here. I'm about to ah! you probably know what he's he's practicing. Uh, so he's practicing. <laughs> he's so gonna use that for sure. It's like he's applying for a job. Uh, yeah, I guess I should apologize for that. But but anyway, I'm good now. I mean, I thought I was good before, but now I realize I was bad. But anyway. <laughs> This is painful. I joined your group and taught the Avatar Fire Bend. Oh, legendary. I'm so happy. Chills. He understands that it's not going to be easy for them to accept. Yeah. Yeah, I wonder what are they going to say? You have to look within yourself to save yourself from your other self. He so would say that. Give a raise to the scriptwriter. <laughs> yeah. Oh dear. Listen, Avatar. <laughs> I can join your group, or I can do something unspeakably horrible to you. He's gonna say, friends. "What would my mum do?" I guess I'm not that good at impersonation. I thought it was brilliant. <laughs> I rose as bad as that's all right. The wind is too loud in my ear. Oh, morning. All your mates are like prisoners. I, he How can just, he be doing this? Yeah, I don't know. He just needs a, like a a little time out. I don't know. Yeah, I know. He needs to regroup. I think he realizes his like massive responsibilities ahead. No, nah, he's just so putting it off. Yeah. yeah. Oh, I'm so excited. <laughs> hello, Zuko here. He went with hello, Zuko here. <laughs> he actually went with that. Is that the only party kept? I hope so. <laughs> he did save him. <laughs> mm. That's a thank you. I know you must be surprised to see me here. And I, uh, I'm good now. And, well, I think I should join your group. Oh, and I can teach firebending. Good to you. Perfect timing. See, I, uh... You want a what now? You can't possibly think that anyone... Yeah, they're going to be protective. I think Aang will accept it, though. That's right. <laughs> he 
doesn't forget. He's Appa got doesn't off forget. the seal of approval. He probably just covered himself in honey or something, so that Appa would lick <laughs> okay. I was wrong to try to capture you, and I'm sorry that I attacked the water tribe. And I never should have sent the Fire Nation assassin after you. I'm going to try to stop you. Ah, you what now? <laughs> Go past no, Sparky, Sparky, boom, man. <laughs> He senses chakras. I want them to be friends so bad. There's no way we can trust you after everything you've done. We'll never let you join us. We need to get That's out. the blocked chakra yeah. speaking. If you won't accept me as a friend, then maybe you'll take me oh. as a prisoner. No, we won't! Get oh. Don't come back. And if we ever see you again, well, we better not see you again. Toph, just put him in some, like, earth... No, I see it from their point of view. I know, I can, I can. He, I respect the way he dealt with that. He'd usually blow up over it. Well, he's, yeah, not like that anymore. Well, yeah, he's changed now, but he's oh, quite calm. I didn't feel good about it. Stupid I am. I mean, what was I thinking? Telling them I sent an assassin after them? Why did I just say Azula did that? They would have believed that? Stupid! <laughs> oh, shit. I feel so sorry for him. I know. I reckon Aang's going to go visit him by himself. That was the problem, because they, they tried to trust him one time before. Don't. Don't remind me. No, that's because of other things you've put in your mouth. <laughs> what was that fish that he was eating and all that? There you go, Toph. The wisest of all of them. The not as much of a jerk as you could have been a ward. Maybe you're all just letting your hurt feelings keep you from thinking clearly. They're lucky she's here, man. Mm. You were there when he had us attacked by pirates. Or when he burned down Kiyoshi Island. Or when he mm. tried to attack me at the fire temple. Why did you even try to defend him? Because he was telling the truth. Tara, Playing devil's advocate. Ang needs to learn firebending. Ang needs a firebending teacher. We can't think of a single person in the world to do the job. Literally. Almost literally. Let's go, Toph. That was mm -hmm. epic. She put her foot down. Well, I guess that settled it. Stupidity. I'm sorry. I've got to call it out. <laughs> <laughs> like, they have her who can... She can literally tell if someone is lying. Yeah. So if he's actually telling the truth, you'd be silly not to accept it, in my opinion. I don't know. Oh, Toph went to visit. Not Ang. Hey! Oh, great. It was a mistake. Get away from me. Oh, this is a mess. We need that Katara healing water ice up. Come back. Oh, poor Toph, damn it. How did that happen? Well, I kind of went to see Zuko last night. You what? Zuko? Uh -huh. I just thought he would be <laughs> helpful to us. And if I talk to him, maybe we could work something out. <laughs> there you go, Katara. Nice. <laughs> I wish I could have worked on him sooner. Yeah, me too. He's crafty, but we'll find a way to catch him. We have to understand yeah. they haven't watched the show. I know, I know. It's hard for me to yeah. say. I've got to be more understanding on their side. And the cruel world has, you know, taught them not to be so trusting. Ah, <laughs> oh, it's Sparky, Sparky, Boom Man. <laughs> you can give it up now. No, Zuko will save them. Yeah. That's the, the act of trust that he needs, I think. Yeah, true. Oh. Let's go. Let's go. Could have got there a little early, Azuko. I don't want you hunting the avatar anymore. He's shouting extra loud. <laughs> yeah. Sparky, sparky, boom man doesn't you stop. Like, what did you say? 
That is a great deal. I don't think there's anything up there, Carly. <gasps> Wait a second. Doesn't like when the terms change like this. What's the go? Oh shit. Oh, that was close. Oh yes. That was sick. We haven't seen that. Yeah. I don't think. Oh, oh. Is she oh, I didn't mm. do shit to him. Too early for her to use the blood bending. They're probably gonna save that for like the finale or something. Probably. I know how to get an angle on it. Oh, careful, please. And use it as a mirror. Oh no, he's gonna throw it. Boomerang. Get his eye. That's kind of dark, isn't it? Oh, look at him doing that quick math. All right, buddy. Don't okay, oh, here we no. go. Soccer! Yes, man! And it got his, his sensitive spot right. He can't do it anymore. No, but at least they can face him now. Aww, no, it did. No, I think he did it. Oh, he won't just, be able to. See? They're retreating back to the same spot. Oh, no, it did some damage. Yep. Mm -hmm. He's going to take down the whole temple. Oh. Did he take himself down? Self-destructed? Oh my gosh! Happened? Yeah, no, he did. He tried it, and it like. I thought I had lost my honor, and that somehow my father could return it to me. But I know now that no one can give you your honor. It's something you earn for yourself by choosing to do what's right. I'm All proud of him. Let's go, man. man. And I know my destiny is to help you restore. That's a that's an Iro like speech. Yeah. <laughs> I'm sorry for what I did to you. It was an accident. Fire can be dangerous and wild. So as a firebender, I need to be more careful and control my bending so I don't hurt people unintentionally. Mm, that speaks to him for sure. Yeah. I think you are supposed to be my firebending teacher. But now I know you understand how easy it is to hurt the people you love. I'd like you to teach me. Oh, man. <laughs> I'm so happy There's such a build-up. Oh yeah, shit. Todd, you're the one that Zuko burned. What do you think? I love that Ang did this. Didn't make the decision himself. It'll give you plenty of time yeah, that is so nice. Burning my feet. <laughs> Sokka, hey, all I want is to defeat the Fire Lord. If you think this is the way to do it, then... Katara is going to be harder to convince, I think. Mm. Katara? Mm. I'll go along with whatever you think is right. Not gonna be happy about it though. I promise. Uh, they're not gonna be buddies, but that's good enough for him. No, that's very realistic. I like that. You know, they're gonna work for the friendship. You never know how things are going to work out, but if you keep an open mind and an open heart, we haven't had many present scenes with Iro. I've noticed. Yep. Some. Oh. 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 Oh shit. <laughs> I'm so conflicted. He gets oh. it. He gets it. I love that. I tell you why I love that episode because I feel like that was one of those episodes that can easily be messed up mm. by the writers. If, like, you make one wrong move where something feels out of place, you mess up so much character development. Mm -hmm. I mean, even I was saying some of the decision-making from Aang and the gang was a little bit stupid, but that was just... That was me. Like, I have seen the show. They haven't. <laughs> you know, they don't know what Zuko's been yeah. through and how he's changed. I just thought, like, as soon as Toph said he's not lying, that's the cue, right? Because this is desperation. They're, mm. they're in desperate times here. I know, but then there's also pride. Yeah, and there's other, like, these are humans, right? And they're yeah. not just humans. They're, like, 14, 15 years old. So they're more emotional than most as well. Mm -hmm. I mean, some are even younger. Toph and Aang are younger than that. So yep. I get it, right? I just love that. I felt like every character reacted 
exactly how they should. Mm-hmm. Katara's probably got more beef with Zuko than anyone else here, really. Aang, I love it how he asked the rest of them. Yeah, I love that as well. Before he made the decision himself, because they've well, they've gone on this journey together. Then Zuko, I like the small detail of him not snapping, because he snaps all the time, but it shows that he's obviously changed and made up his mind and things are clearer to him. So now he's now because he knows his destiny and he's got his mind is sort of clear now. He knows what he wants. So yeah. there's no point like, you know, acting up and Yeah, no, exactly. And he realizes that he was in the wrong all this time. And I feel like the reason he was snapping was because he was so desperately trying to like find himself. There was a sense of urgency. Mm. Um, no reason for that anymore. Yeah. He knows now what his true calling is. Crystal balance. Yeah, he can't mess this up as well. Like I think he now realizes his responsibility of teaching firebending to Aang. Yeah. Yeah, so I guess he just he doesn't want to mess that up further, but yeah, he understands why they might respond that way. And even though it's like tricky to see Katara threaten him like that after we saw what Zuko's been through and all of that, like you fully understand, you know, he did some despicable things at the at yeah. the start of the series, or not just at the start, but throughout the series. And the callbacks to Iroh and the things that Iroh said, we got new flashbacks there as well. And mm-hmm. uh, I felt like that, that gave a lot of context to this moment too. I love how he had the portrait of him. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, that was really nice. That's so cute. He keeps, it, he keeps Iroh with him at all times. I'm waiting to see him in the present. Like Iroh's had a couple of scenes yeah. in the prison. I think they've, they've got something saved for him maybe. Yeah, definitely. Like the writers are not stupid. No. They're like Iroh is... The king of the world. So. <laughs> I think that's you. I think that's what you say. But yeah. No, he's... Nah, they know how goaded he is. So yeah. yeah, for him not to have any part in the last part of this series would be crazy. I really like a couple of the details in, in the episode where it wasn't as simple as Zuko rocking up and them like just saying, yeah, fine, teach me. Like you had to work for it a little yeah. bit. There's been 50 odd episodes of build up. There had to be a little bit of back and forth, I think. And still, it's not like everything is all friendly. You know, they haven't forgotten. I just feel like it could have easily been messed up and and they didn't mess it up. And it all seems natural and normal. And Zuko's response to it, everyone's response to what's going on here. I just, I'm like you. I just, I want Zuko and Aang to get along so bad. Ever since we saw them fight together without knowing they were fighting together. That was unreal. I'm so excited for the training to start. There's going to be reservations, probably mm. on both ends, mainly for Aang. But I'm very excited to see. Um, maybe they'll, like, bond over it or something. Well, you know what I like about the prospect of him teaching firebending? I feel like Zuko teaching Aang firebending is not only great for Aang, but it's good to see what Zuko has learned and what we've seen him go through all the way through the mm. series. I feel like it'll be a culmination of his character development also seen in the teaching because he was remember with his firebending he was quite erratic and, yeah. and crazy with it and he was filled with a lot of anger and all of that so yep. i think it would be good to see everything he's gone through and everything we've seen him go through uh in the training as well mm-hmm. the little detail of Appa being accepting of zuko was good as well because yeah. you know he doesn't forget he did save him in a perilous time exactly yeah that was so important that Appa was freed then and there yeah, and then obviously um, Soccer coming up with a conspiracy that he had the, the honey on him. It was pretty funny. I just, I, I really liked how all the characters responded in a very in-character sort of way, if you kind of get what I'm saying. Yeah. I'm just sort of thinking, if that really was the end of the assassin, what was the point of the assassin? I understand that they were running away from him, from him for a little bit, but I can't really see the bigger picture there. Like, I feel like... The series probably could have done without the assassin and I wouldn't have any issues. Oh, no, well, I think the assassin was in the end used as Zuko's conscience. Okay. In a way, right. it was like a metaphor for Zuko's conscience. And then it had to be Zuko that, I guess, made up for, for that mistake. And it had to be him to, to save them in the end and regain that trust back. So, yeah, right, okay. But, but you're yeah. right, there, there wasn't much to, to the assassin, yeah, right? Yeah, I just I thought that there would be more to... Maybe there still is. Maybe, like... Because, like, why has he got the eye and what's with the hand? And Oh, okay. So you're saying the law of, like, this character could have been explored a little bit more? Uh, yeah. I think it I think it will be. I'm not sure. It's but very mysterious otherwise. I can see the use 
and why the character was introduced because how else was Zuko going to, uh, you know, get their trust? Yeah, I guess. So I say from that point of view. Thank you so much for watching our reaction. If you liked it, please give us a thumbs up and subscribe. It would really help us out. For early access to all of our reactions, you can support us on Patreon if you'd like. And again, thank you so much again. We'll see you in the next one. Bye. <laughs>